perfume and I girls always like to be so pretty and like I'm one of those girls like yeah my first time actually making perfume so let's get started so what we have here is a bottle of water you need cotton balls we have our two scents and then we have the rest of our senses I got them wrote down I'm probably gonna do this one because it's Rose my middle name and it's probably gonna be my special one we're gonna go through all like the ones we're gonna be mixing them adding them together like we're scientists obviously scientists they need a and then you put your favorite scent smell in the syringe. Okay, first step, get this, pour water in it. What you're gonna do, use your tweezers to grab them and put them in. Okay, now you're gonna put this in. Okay, now what you're gonna do is you're gonna push the syringe down and then pull the water. Now we're gonna put some color in, one drop. A tiny little bit of color to have appeal to the eye. And now what we're gonna do is mix it. After you're done mixing it, you pour it into here. Okay, we're all done. Don't fill it all the way up. Because last time I filled it up, it went really bad. A good scent makes you feel happy. People have scents, plants have scents. Also, soil has scents, food has scents. Everything has scents. So next time, pay attention how certain smells make you feel. Now, moving on to the next one. This time, I'm gonna add some together. We're gonna add apple and jasmine, and we're gonna put it in here, mix them up, and then put them in here. This one's very easy, because it's super delicate. I'm just gonna pour it. Okay, that's good. I just poured jasmine in. Now I'm gonna pour apple in. Let's grab a clean stick. We mix them together. Okay, now let's smell it. It actually smells like jasmine, apple-y, tree flavor. It smells very good. I would name it. Apple Jacks. I like Apple Jacks. Let's pour it in the bubble. And I already got it on my hands, so yeah. Whoa. Let's just put the bubble on. In 1921, listen to this. Chanel number no. five was the most popular perfumes in the whole world. It was named simply because it was the fifth most favorite formula to Coco Chanel by the famous Perfumer by Ernest Boat. Boat? 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 Ernest Boat? So now what we're gonna do is all these, we're gonna pour into this and mix them up well, a little bit so we don't want it to overflow. This one I'm using is Helium Troop. See this? This is Lily. Put it, pour it. We're gonna add some water to it to not make it so strong. Let's smell it. It smells weird. <laughs> it smells weird. It smells like flour. It smells like flour. You can get a very, very, very fancy bottles to put your perfume in. This is my favorite one, the apple and the jasmine. So let's pour it in the purple bottle, my favorite. It's going well, it's going well. That's enough. By the way, don't taste your perfume. It tastes disgusting. I tasted it before. Thanks for watching Sunday's Boo Victoria on this perfume lab kit. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below. Until next time, bye!
Make sure to like, subscribe, and share these videos with your friends.